there was always a big crowd of people in the archway, wasn't there? Oh yeah, there was. Well, it was the meeting place of the yeah. college, wasn't it? And you'd have to pass through them to get to your lectures. Yeah. yeah. And I remember I used to wait for my friend out at the gate so that the two of us could go in Which together did. for courage. I know. <laughs> there was temporary buildings back here in the 70s and the societies, including Dramasoc, used them for rehearsals and indeed we rehearsed the early productions of Druid here. The truck to help with sets going up to uh, grammar the school. grammar school where we put the productions on. The college is so beautiful, which I think even at the time we probably acknowledged. Yes, But we to did. be able to continue to have a relationship with it, with the students and with this organisation, this seat of learning from which it emerged, it's tremendous. It really is. We had the Latin Hall there and the Greek Hall there, yeah. the Aula Maxima where we did all our exams. We had the Lady Gregory played by myself, who yes. um, opened, who else? we knocked on the door of the, That's right. of the archway. We had the doors closed. Closed, doors closed to the archway, so we knocked for admittance and myself and the audience came in. Yeah. So it was, it was amazing to yeah. do it 45 years later. Yeah. I'm still very proud of the time I spent here and I'm proud that this, this uh, quad was part of my life. Yeah, absolutely. You know? Still is. Yeah, it still is, very much still yeah. is. How oh, brilliant place it is to study, to, to be part of. It's just fantastic to be a student here where, in a college where so much is happening in the world of theatre. So you have the theatres and you have the drama society and there's so many people who just want to do things and you really feel the encouragement for, from other people around you who just want to do theatre with you and you feel like you're such part of such a creative community. It really gives you a wide range of knowledge and I think that's really the core to making theatre is understanding all the different aspects to it and how they all mesh together to make one beautiful thing. And I remember as a young woman, and Gary had it in, in spades, that anything is possible if you try, if you work. We were always encouraged to try and, and, you know, that's what it's all about, isn't it? Absolutely.